And you got 8,500 Kelvin. Holy All right. That's full blast. I'm out. I feel like I'm getting a tan right now. Hello and welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, I'm Ron. Today we're going to be talking about the best small pocket LED light of 2019. In 2019, you've got a lot of lighting options, I know because I've been looking for a while now. You've got options for manufacturers like Aperture and Sakani, but I think this LED is the best of the bunch and the other manufacturers have their work cut out for them. So what is this great pocket LED? It's the extremely portable and versatile boiling BL P1 pocket LED video light. This light has everything I've been looking for in a portable LED. This is going to be a quick video on what I would consider to be the best small LED light of 2019, so let's jump right into it. My goal in putting this video together was to save you some time as I've researched many other small LEDs, and in my opinion, this LED comes out on top for overall quality functionality and cost. Again, it's the Bowling BLP1 Pocket LED Video Light. Let me put a few of the specs up on the screen for you and then we'll jump right into the actual review. You've got a wide color temperature of 2500 Kelvin to 8500 Kelvin. You can select from 360 colors in RGB mode with saturation adjustments. You've got accurate brightness adjustments from zero to 100. Nine color simulations or special effect modes. At full power, you'll get 140 minutes or 2.5 hours. It costs about $159 US. It's got 200 90 LEDs and lamp life's 50,000 hours at a weight of about 260 grams. Now, full disclosure, I bought this with my own money and this is not a sponsored video. I'm posting this video because I think it's a really good LED light for anyone who's been looking. I have provided you the links below if you're interested in buying this product, but watch the video first because I know it'll answer some of your key questions. This is a full multi-purpose light. It's great for nearly any lighting situation you could have. Uh, it can act as your key light, a background light, mood lighting, or if you do any type of photography or videography, uh, it works great at night as well. Uh, it's great for any type, really any type of setting. If you're looking for a great portable light for really any type of lighting situation, this is the light I'd want in my bag. It's small, its build quality is really good. It's made with high strength aviation aluminum. It is reasonably priced relative to any of the other competitors out there. Here I put up a Kelvin color temperature scale just so you can see the type of lighting this LED puts out. You can see from the chart that full daylight comes in on the far right of the scale around 6500 Kelvin and this LED is capable of producing an output of 8500 Kelvin. Yes, it's really bright. I feel like it nearly blinded myself a few times and my wife probably feels the same way as well. One of the main reasons I really enjoy this light is the full spectrum of color ranges you can really get out of this guy. Unlike a lot of other small lighting solutions, you don't have to use color gels or multiple plastic lenses or inserts to get all the color ranges. You'll see here on the back a full spectrum of colors that you can get out of this little guy. It's really nice. Now for comparison purposes, take a look at the size of this thing. Uh, the boiling point is about the same size as my cell phone. The other reason I love this light is it's extremely intuitive to operate. You don't need to pull out the owner's manual every time you want to use it. I love the simplicity. It's got a really easy to find on off button right here on the top. All the adjustments can be made with the wheel on the side as I mentioned before. There's even a color chart on the back to help you dial in your color settings. You have your set button which is used to change between three different modes. You have your CCT mode, your HSI mode and your special, uh, special effects mode. In CCT mode or correlated color temperature mode, if you rotate the multifunction wheel, the color temperature can be selected between 2500 Kelvin and 8500 Kelvin. Typically color temps over 5000 Kelvin are called cool colors, bluish in color, while the lower color, color temperatures between 2700 and 3000 Kelvin are called warm colors or yellowish. In HSL mode, which stands for hue, saturation, and luminance, if you rotate the multifunction wheel, you can select all the colors, zero to 360 color gamut. Hue is the degree on the color wheel, zero or 360 is red, 120 is green, 240 is blue, and the numbers in between reflect different shades. If you're not sure of the values, they also show here on the front of your LED for quick reference. After selecting the color, just press the multifunction button to switch to your saturation adjustment options, and then rotate the multifunction wheel again to adjust the concentration of the selected color from 100 to zero percent. In special effects mode, press the set button to switch out of the effect mode. Press the multifunction button again to select each effect mode type and scroll the function wheel to select an A, B, or C effect type. 
the brightness of each special effect type can be adjusted by the dim button from zero to 100. You've got two lightning effects. A TV special effect. A police car effect. An ambulance effect. A fire truck effect and a slow RGB color effect. A fast color RGB color effect and a candlelight effect. You've got a dim dial all the way on the bottom. This is going to adjust the brightness from 0 to 100, 0 being completely off and 100 being your max. Also, unlike a lot of the other lights, this one really lets you dial in your settings so you can make those small incremental adjustments easily. It doesn't just suddenly shoot from a very uh, dim lit situation to an extremely bright lit situation with the LED. Uh, the charging interface is a Type-C interface that supports QC 3.0 fast charging options. And the final thing worth noting is the 360 degree rotating bracket arm uh, comes with this. This is a really great feature and well thought out by Bowling. They also provide you a cold shoe mount that you can set up in more ways than I could probably come up with. Here's a basic setup I'm using right now, but the adjustments for this are really endless. And finally, this is everything you get with the product. You get the Bowling BLP1 itself, a quarter 20 cold shoe mount adapter, a cloth bag to hold everything, a small wrench in case you need to tighten the bracket arm uh, if it's loose, and your USB-C charging cable along with a few stickers. Again, I, I'll put all the links below for this product and uh, it's really an all-in-one lighting solution. If you're looking for something that does it all, this gets the job done. You can also support the channel by buying the links that I provided below. If you've been following my channel for a while now, you know I only post products I would buy myself or truly believe in. I also want to thank everyone for supporting the channel. I didn't mention it previously, but to date this channel has received over a million views uh, and that just blows my mind, so thank you to everybody. Uh, don't forget you can follow me on Instagram and don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up if you found it that provided you some value. Also, don't forget to like, subscribe, and ring that bell for future video notifications. And until next time, take care.